With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, the question is the correct increasing bond angle order is and here we have the options but we can see here all of these uh, BF3, NF3, PF3 and CLF3. So we will be discussing it first and then we will be arranging it. So the first one is BF3. So if we consider BF3 first, we will be finding out the hybridization of this molecule. So it will be half V that is val uh, number of valence electrons in the central atom plus M number of monovalent atoms minus C cationic charge plus A anionic charge. So if we calculate the hybridization of this, then it will be half 3 as number of valence electrons uh, in the central atom is 3 plus 3 that is 3 fluorine atoms is present, monovalent atom, so it will be equal to 3. So when the value comes out to be 3, it is sp3 sp2 hybridization and it is trigonal planar. And the bond angle here is 120 degrees. Now let's see the next one. So the next one is NF3. Now let's calculate the hybridization of this. So it will be equal to half. Number of electrons in the valence shell is 5. So 5 plus 3, it comes out to be 8 by 2. This value is sp3. Sorry, this is 4. This is 4 and the, uh, when the value is 4, it is sp3 hybridization. And it should be tetrahedral geometry. But the bond angle in the case of NF3 is 101.9 degree. It is like if we see NH3 it was 107 degree but here in case of NF3 it is 101.9 degree because if we consider like this tetrahedral geometry of this fluorine. So if this is the structure of fluorine then what happens is fluorine is electronegative as compared to this nitrogen so it will be withdrawing electron towards itself. So now what happens is uh, the electron density now this NF bond increases. So this lone pair bond pair repulsion will be less that is why its bond angle decreases to this much. Now the next is PF3. Similarly half sorry hybridization will be equal to So hybridization will be equal to half number of valence electrons it will be 5 number of monovalent atoms 3 no cationic no anionic charge so again this value will come out to be 4 when the value is 4 it is sp3 hybridization and tetrahedral geometry. So as it is tetrahedral geometry the bond angle should be the bond angle here is 109 degrees as it has tetrahedral geometry. So the, it will, the structure will be like so now the last one CLF3 so first we will be calculating the hybridization so hybridization will be equal to half so number of valence electrons here is 7 so it will be 7 plus 3 10 by 2 5 so when the value is 5 it is sp3 dehybridization and the geometry is trigonal bi trigonal bi pyramidal so the structure will be like somewhat cl there are three bonds which will be like this f present here f present here f present here and the lone pairs will be present here so as we can see this shape is t shape and the bond angles here is 90 degree now if we write the increasing order cl f3 as it has 90 degree bond angle sorry if I am writing the increasing order then BF3 has the largest bond angle with 120 degree followed by PF3 with 109 degree later it will be of NF3 101 degree and CLF3 at last so let's see if which one of the order is correct here so the last option we can see here is BF3 has the highest bond angle followed by NF3, later it is PF3 and at last CLF3. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.